Hello, thanks again for joining me for Move Your Body and Speak English. We're going to continue with homonyms. He looks like he's in pain. His toe is red. Looks like he stubbed his toe. His face looks like he's, it's in pain as well. His whole body looks like it's in pain. Pain. Here's a window frame. Here's a window. And inside the window are sheets of glass. They're called panes. We've got one, two, three, four window panes. Pain, pain. Let's have a look at another one. Is an apple. It's a whole apple. It's not half an apple. It's an entire apple. It's a whole apple. Looks like a hole in the ground. Be careful, there's a hole in the ground. You could fall in. It could be a deep hole or it could be a shallow hole. It's a hole in the ground. Here's a whole apple. With this hole puncher, I can make a hole in the paper. I just made a hole in the paper with the hole puncher. A whole ball, a whole white ball. Not a half a ball, but a whole ball. Let's look at one more. Flower. Flower. Looks like there's flour in the bag. A bag of flour. Flour. We use flour for baking, cakes and pies, cookies, biscuits, scones. Mmm. Flour? and flower. Sound the same? Mean different things? Have different spelling?
Let's go ahead and do some movements. But before we do that, I want to bring back one homonym from last week. Eight, it's the number eight. It's the figure eight. Oh dear, the boy ate too much chocolate over the holidays and then didn't feel so well. So here with the figure eight, It's like two circles and then there's a crossover point right here so we make a big circle and then in the middle we cross to the other side if this figure eight is where our hips are we can move our hips like a figure eight let's go ahead and do that Let's just warm up our hands, feel our feet in the ground, on the floor, nice and firm. Rub our hands together until you feel nice and warm. Hmm, getting warm. Okay, and shake that out. And now cup our hands and let's just hit the hips. Wake up the hips and now to the side. You can feel the hips vibrate. And then to the back we make soft fists. so good you can feel the bones vibrate okay just circle the shoulders three times inhale exhale okay and now placing our hands on our hip bones we're going to make that figure eight with our hips so we move to the side around like a circle and then we come to the middle and cross over to the other side. Our knees are easy, not locked. So we make a, a circle, a half a circle, we cross over to the middle and then go to the other side making a half a circle. And so in the end, we make the figure eight with our hips and go a little bit faster, easier. How can you make the figure eight a little easier? A little bit faster, keeping the knees soft, feet on the ground. And let that go. And now we're going to just make a big circle with our hips. And go the other way. Knees are always slightly bent. And stopping that. Feeling our feet firmly on the ground. And now we're gonna focus on our neck. So place your hands around your neck. And then imagine that you have horns. So you wanna stick the horns out. And we're gonna make a figure eight with our neck using the horns to help us. Is 
It's easier if you close your eyes, but if you don't want to do that, you keep them open. Your knees are soft. And follow the movement with your eyes, even if they are closed. So you're making like a half circle one way, and then you cut cross over in the middle and make another circle with the other way. And try and make it easier every time. Less tension, more ease. See if you can find a comfort place inside yourself while you do this. If you need to make it smaller, whatever you need to do to make it easier. You could even just imagine doing it. So making the figure eight, coming to the center now and pausing. Ah, breathe out and go the other way now. So good for your neck. Looking at the computer a lot or the phone gives what gives you um can give you a neck ache, a sore neck. So this is really good for you. Ah, and bring your hands down and just shake out. A present from my grandmother. Ho, ho, ho. Merry Christmas. Ho, ho, ho. Merry Christmas. Bye. See you next time.